we're at a moment of tremendous uh, importance in global diplomacy. We've come to understand over the past four decades just how much threat humanity is posing to our own survival and the well-being of future generations through our effects on the planet. This is, in my opinion, the defining challenge of the coming generation. The great outcome of Rio Plus 20 was to call for Sustainable Development Goals, SDGs. Goals not only about the economy and poverty, but goals that embrace social inclusion, goals of equality, goals of fairness and human rights, and goals of environmental sustainability. Goals that all of us can embrace, teach, understand, promote, and act upon. And the world governments are in the process of negotiating these goals now. Bob Watson, a great scientist statesman sitting in front of me who has been a great guru for all of us on all of this uh, since the beginning has done a wonderful process led with uh, Dave Griggs at Monash of defining how these goals can work for a country like Australia. It's pathbreaking because what Australia is doing is going to be taken up all over the world as showing that these are goals truly universali universalizable, let me say that. They can be made universal, they can be made applicable, they can be defined to the real needs and real conditions of every country. We need to think, and we need to think in an organized and planned direction for the safety of the planet. And when we do so, wonderful things can happen.